Welcome back, everybody, to another All Things Nerd video. As always, my name is Nathan. Welcome back to the Warlords of Draenor expansion, where we are currently back in Skyreach. And uh, I'm excited to be back here because I've been wanting to do a video on this place for a long time. I did do a Skyreach video a couple months back uh, in the actual dungeon. But what I wanted to do today was to break in the uninstant version of Skyreach and see what is actually behind the flames of the uh, Skyreach dungeon, if there's anything actually inside. And uh, I'm actually going to show you how to get inside and in the middle of this thing, and we're going to see what's exactly in there. So there's a really particular place that you can fly to, and I'm going to show you right now. So I'm actually right on like the uh, second level you can see here. So you have flames down here and flames down here, and they're obviously, you know, guarding the entrance because they don't want you in there. But uh, there's a way that you can get in there, and it's right over here. You can actually fly into the wall. And once you get into this wall area, it may take you just a minute to kind of figure out. Um, but you can kind of like jump up into here. There we go. And then once you're in here, you can just uh, come up here. And there we go. So we are, that's like the hardest part. So you just kind of go into the wall over there. And then once you do that, you can actually just, uh, you should be able to just like jump straight through. Uh, where is it? There's a spot where you can actually just like fly straight through. And I don't remember if it's like the middle. Oh, here it is right here. And then you fly into this room and you can actually stand on this. So there we go. We're actually inside of the uninstant version of Skyreach. Which is really awesome because I've been wanting to get in here for a while. I kept, I kept, remember, I kept uh, forgetting to make a video of this place because um, I kept coming to Draenor and then uh, I would be like, is there anything else I wanted to do here? <laughs> but uh, yeah, I've been wanting to make a video on this place for a long time. But here we are, guys. We're inside. It's really exciting. I do love the... Uh, like the PNG image they got going on in the background here. So it acts like you're actually seeing the dungeon from the outside. Uh, really cool artwork going on in the background. And all of this is actually solid. So you, you can just fly around in here. This right here is not. You'll actually just fly straight through this. So this is nothing you can actually stand on other than the bottom. Which is really strange to me. That they didn't make this like standable. I mean you're never supposed to be in here anyways. But... I, I, I thought for sure they would have made this, you can walk, and then, but I never thought you would have, like, the bottom where you could walk down in here. I didn't think this would be solid at all, but it is, and I love that everything kind of comes together like a puzzle, in a way. <clears throat> Excuse me. When I think of behind the scenes of, like, dungeons, and when they just put, like, a piece of, like, a, like a picture... I just see like a giant puzzle that they put together basically. So really cool. Um, I hope you guys come check this out. I thought it was kind of neat to see inside of here. And um, uh, as you guys know, I've been sick, so I'm kind of recovering from being sick. Uh, but I wanted to at least push out a video to have for Monday and the start of the week and to show you guys how to get inside this place because I thought it was really fun to get inside. And I love seeing this kind of stuff. You can just fly straight back out, and that will actually get you back out um, from where you're supposed to be. But that's it, guys. That's how to get in the uninstant version of Sky Reach. There's nothing really too much left in here. As you can see, if we actually go into here, we'll most likely DC. But uh, that is what's inside. I haven't actually seen if there's anything else. Oh, here we go. Okay, so there is a backside as well. Um... Look at that. That's kind of cool looking. So that would be behind the door on the other side. And I think there's some more flames over here as well. But if we actually fly up into here, let's see if we can go up into this tower thing. Oh, we can. That's so cool. Look at this. Nice. So we are actually inside of this thing now. Oh, okay. Never mind. We came outside. <laughs> there we go. So there you guys go. That is what's inside of the uninstant version of Skyridge. I hope you guys have been enjoying these little just inside videos. I know I did one of the uh, the Dawnbreaker entrance. And I thought that was a lot of fun to get back there and see everything. I just love like these little quick videos where you could just get inside things real quick. I've been really enjoying the War Within expansion. I got to tell you guys, the War Within expansion has been kicking my butt. Um, 
with OOB. Blizzard has really locked down on people with OOB, and they really do not want you getting outside their maps anymore and exposing secrets. So uh, those are definitely going to be a challenge, and I'm having a little bit of a hard time trying to break out of those things. So give me some more time um, of the raid and the dungeon, all that with the War Within. That content might come a little later just because of how difficult it is. So I'm going to work on some great paths for you guys to break out of. Um, I know I keep saying this, but we're almost to the Shadowlands. We just got one more month. We're going to kick off 2025 with all of the Shadowlands breakdown. So for like the first three, four months of 2025, we're just going to be doing Shadowlands content. And we're going to be doing scenarios, we're going to be doing the dungeons, the raids, and we're going to get out of bounds and see what is outside of those things. For those of you that joined me on the live stream the other night, I had a lot of fun doing that on YouTube. I'm definitely going to be doing more of those. And a lot of you saw that I was able to break out of castle, the castle uh, in the Shadowlands raid, so that was fun. And uh, I can't wait to show that off, uh, what exactly you need to do in order to complete that raid. So... Anyways, guys, there you go. That is the uninstant version of Skyreach. And uh, as always, my name is Nathan. I will catch you on the next video. Take care.